but we, you're our first person we've spoke to about the paracetamol, mm. but there's 100,000 people admitted to hospital every year with an accidental overdose of paracetamol. So there's like 200 deaths a year with just accidental overdose. Just in the and UK. people just, just in the yeah. UK. And people don't know. It's, you've got to leave that four to six hour time period in between each. And it states on the box for everyone it does. to see. Do you know what? The, well, people just you know crack them open I mean? and just see. Because they think, oh, they sell them in the home bargain, they sell them in the Asda. Do you know? I can get, get them, them in the corner, corner shop. shop. It's, it's in Calpo. So, it can't be so that you bad. don't think it's that bad, but it's the most toxic, toxic drug that you can have. For your liver. Oh, well, I get that. having a liver transplant. Mm -hmm. In that space of time, Leanne, I know, that scary. is scary. Scary yeah. fast, honestly. Hey, paracetamol, it's in the Asda, it's in the old one bargain, it's in the colder shops, it's in Calpol. My daughter's yeah. 20 next month, and I'd still give her a spoonful of um, Calpol, that's it. She won't, I won't let her have oh, anything. Yeah. There's not she... many people that oh, I've got it. You know, I've got a hangover, or I've got a. That's the worst time to take it. And people do do it because yeah. you've got a pound and Eddie. Yeah. Oh, I'll take two paracetamol. Oh, I've still got this headache. Yeah. And look well, you know, look what happened. I know.